Have you ever stopped to think if Apple's next iPhone is actually better? Or if we're all just getting hypnotized by shiny new designs and clever marketing? Well, the iPhone 17 Pro and Pro Max might finally give us a real reason to upgrade. With their official launch just around the corner, leaks and insider reports are pouring in. And they hint at major changes, not just incremental updates. This year, Apple isn't just adding polish. They're reshaping the entire iPhone experience. Take the rumored iPhone 17 Air, for example. It's expected to be thinner, lighter, and come with a completely redesigned camera system. Think of it as Apple going back to the drawing board, much like they did with the iPhone X in 2017. That was a turning point in design, and now it feels like we're on the edge of another. But looks are only part of the story. Under the hood, Apple's new A19 Pro chip is reportedly blowing past last year's A18 in performance tests. Leaks suggest Geekbench scores over 4,000 in single-core and nearly 10,000 in multi-core, numbers that would have sounded sci-fi a few years ago. What does that mean for the average user? Apps will launch faster, multitasking will be smoother, and everything from gaming to video editing will feel more effortless. Even if you're just doom-scrolling through Instagram, the speed boost will be hard to ignore. Now, let's talk about the display because Apple isn't holding back there either. The iPhone 17 Pro Max might come with a huge 6.9-inch screen, while the Pro version is expected to stick with a more compact 6.3-inch size. Both will likely keep the ProMotion 120 Hz refresh rate. And here's where it gets exciting. An anti-reflective. Coating that cuts down glare and makes the display more durable. Whether you're watching videos in sunlight or scrolling at night, the visuals are going to be crisper, cleaner, and just flat out better. Even the color choices are getting smarter. We're talking titanium black, gray, and blue. Not just for aesthetics, but to tap into emotion. Black offers that executive class, sleek confidence. Gray is calm and professional, a no-flash kind of cool. And blue, that's for the creators, the techies, the trendsetters. Apple clearly knows its audience. But what's really taking this generation to the next level is Apple intelligence. No, not just a buzzword. Real tools that you'll actually use. Live translation that works directly in messages and FaceTime. A smarter Genmoji system that lets you create emojis that actually look like your friends. And with everything running on device, your privacy stays locked down. It's not just powerful, it's personal. You can even use your camera to identify objects, translate text on the go, or get smart suggestions for things like adding events to your calendar just by taking a screenshot. It's the kind of stuff that used to feel futuristic, but now is just your phone being brilliant. And with developer tools powered by Apple's new foundation models, app creators can now tap into this intelligence with just a few lines of code. That means your favorite apps are about to get a whole lot smarter. Offline, fast, and private. So, are the iPhone 17 Pro and Pro Max worth the wait? From what we've seen so far, the answer looks like a yes. And not just because of performance, but because of how much smarter and more useful the iPhone is becoming. If you're as excited as we are, make sure to hit that subscribe button, give this video a like, and don't forget to check out our deep dive on Apple Intelligence and the brand new iPhone 17 Air. You won't want to miss what's coming next.